Talk about a photo finish. Shona Miller dives across the line, Jason Rubin. Is this how you would act if you were coming into the final stretch? Do you think that you'd be able to no. spring forward? Never in a million years, and I can tell you why. But I, we'll I want get to, know, to it later. I want to know why, because it is an interesting point of view. But many people would think that when you dive, you give yourself a better possible chance of winning, like outstretch, try to get yourself across the line. And this was the actual situation. If you look at these images, there has been fen some phenomenal images from Rio. We were basking in the glory of the real images well, the other gonna, day. We're going to do a clip towards the end of the Olympics, like the 10 greatest pictures from uh, no, there's some great ones. the Olympics, and then probably the 10 pictures that they're not showing you. As I well, just to contrast it, but Getty Images, which we get to use their, their photos, has done an unbelievable job. So, props. We've oh. never given Getty Images props. Well, they just, props, the Getty Images. In general, in general, don't usually get the credit. It's just like, oh, look, there's a fantastic picture of Taylor Swift. Give the guy some credit. Jimmy Lenses. Show me the pictures. Jimmy Lenses did not take these photos <laughs> you're about to see, by the way. Maybe he did. Oh! oh Fully outstretched. I like how they have Comic Sans font for the track. <laughs> <laughs> Never use Comic Sans. It's like the guy who, uh, who threw, put in his two-week resignation in Comic Sans. <laughs> can never be taken seriously. You can't do it seriously. So, according to uh, the reports, is that it wasn't an intentional dive, it was out of necessity. Losing yeah. her footing and had to try to find some sort of way to try and make up ground and therefore it resulted in a outstretched dive to try and make sure that she still would medal and it turned out to be a very mm. beneficial choice indeed. A gold medal. Uh, gold so medal. the internet is actually split on this one. Uh, or at least Reddit is. When I was going through the Reddit thread of what people thought of this, there is the outwardly ridiculous to w saying um, the outwardly ridiculous against her saying that you know that that you should be disqualified for diving. It's a foot race, not a like if you want to do that, do the long jump, yeah. like or other forms of track and field events. Um, and then the other side of it is it's awesome, it's epic. What a, f a photo finish, literally. Uh, here's the facts of the matter, though. Um, for one, this happened in 2008 at the Beijing Olympics. Same thing. Internet didn't freak out as much about it. I look back. I don't think it was. I don't think it was. It was in a qualifying heat. It wasn't in a final like this one was. And two, according to the runners' world, I can tell you a story eventually about my 1600 meter races in high school where people have tried this. I've seen it happen twice. Uh, but when you dive, you lose all of your forward momentum. Therefore, she didn't purposely dive. If she purposely dove, she would have undoubtedly lost that race. Yeah. She was falling forward, hence the forward momentum that she still had. And the second she got her like a, like her foot on the ground, she pushed off to go forward and got ahead of her. So yes, it is still undoubtedly a dive forward. I don't think it was an intentional dive. She lost her footing, lost her balance, all the forward m momentum. If you were to just plant and dive, would take off. 1600 meter race in my junior year of high school. It's a mile, four laps around the track. Uh, or as we were joking yesterday on our test of our podcast, that's coming. The, the point one seven of a mile run. And Usain Bolt wins 0 0.25 miles. <laughs> the 0, 0, the 0 0.10 mile. Um, some guy tried this at a, a different high school. We're running around. We're going through. It's the final lap, fourth time around. And a guy who was trying to catch, he was coming from about fourth because I finished second. My teammate finished first, and this guy finished third. He was coming around from fourth. He catches everybody on the back end, uh, the final 100-meter stretch of it. He dives forward, and all three of us pass him before he crosses the line. It was a close race, but all three of us passed him, and afterward, he looked completely shocked like because he thought he had it. The difference is you have to stop to plant your feet and go forward. Yeah. Therefore, this whole idea of like, oh, why don't more people try this? Because it's a terrible strategy, and it does not work in this case. Did. It did. Memes, Francis. The memes are memes. what matters. And I've by never the way, also the headlines is uh Allison Phoenix wins, wins silver. silver. Talk about talk about a poor headline. Where's the recommend where's the, the deserved mention of the Bahamas Miller? That needs to be first. Bahamas Miller takes gold, Allison Felix takes silver. Well it's NPR, it's in America. She no, no, is no, no, the no. American, so they want to use her I'm, name I was, to I the media. It was a joke. Memes! Should have dove for it, Cam. <laughs> Bleacher. Sean Miller. Point. Sean Miller did. <laughs> God, that's good. Oh, the XL Wave Rider. I love slip and slides. Those look fun. That just.
Too, too perfect. That's too perfect. Next, uh, when the club free before well. 11, it's 10.59. <laughs> That's why I got 3,000 retweets. I mean, that's a good one. <laughs> oh, man. Amazing. And, uh, the of course. <laughs> that's so, like, it's, I think the best memes are the ones that they, like, you can't even tell us. Yeah, you have meme. to look twice. You have to look twice. Yeah. Oh, man. The Olympics has caused a fantastic social reaction. Like, there has been a lot of things said that have to be acknowledged, but in general, I've enjoyed the Olympics. Like, in general, I've enjoyed the way that we have reacted to it. And you mentioned a valid point, is, like, in back in 08, if any of the things that happened today back in 08 right. um, of photo-esque conversations, they're not going to be turned into a million different memes and GIFs because we are now eight years ahead. Correct. And everything, everything is analyzed through a meme and a GIF. Like, our jobs will probably soon be replaced by a guy sitting here with an iPad going, MJ's face. MJ's, MJ's face, MJ's that's face true. On this guy. MJ's, MJ's face. face on that So I had to bring up uh, uh, two other really quick uh, track events that happened. For one, there is... I, I found the dumbest rule in sports. Interesting. I found one. This, is, one. this is crazy. So a uh, uh, French sprinter, uh, Wilhelm Bolklein, if I'm pronouncing that oh, right. Oh, Willie Bolklein? Was disqualified from the 110-meter hurdles on Monday night in Rio after he false started just before the gun. It's a one-strike policy. You are just <sighs> done. How f I think it should be two. If you do it twice, like a double fault, you lose 15 points. It's, it's love 15 like in tennis, right? You see where I'm going with I this? See where you're going. You got you got a double fault. There can't be. You can't train for four years. You to can't put everything on the line to just be a little bit antsy before that gun goes off for your race that you've been putting your whole life towards. You can't kick them out for that. That's awful. That, that is, is a awful. Brutal. Bru I think it's the dumbest rule in sports. Look, look, look. I'm sh I can pull it up. We can do the show the screenshot. It's probably it like a just so minor bad. fifth of a second ahead of the guy. Uh, but by the way. Since I don't see enough outlets running this, congratulations to Andy Murray. The very tearful Andy Murray as he brings home what, uh, the gold for Scotland. He won Britain. the what? 3,200 meter? The yeah, 5K? He, <laughs> he just the decided to take off. He threw his tennis racket away and went, you know what? I'm going for it. And he just didn't stop running. Okay. He Lastly, we had a bunch of comments. Uh, the guy who set the record for the 800 meter, uh, who broke Michael Johnson's record from lane eight. <laughs> My God. You know, more, you're the crappiest lane you get. You get and they do it by qualifying. That's why you want to win your heat because yeah. you get a better lane selection if you win your heat. It is randomized like one three or one two four five if you are in the top four or something like that. And then what two, what three. lap is it that you can cut? Is it like a certain? It's to cut about it? if I'm correct, it's about a hundred meters after your start. Ah. I think the second you wrap around, you see him cut in. Interesting. You also, it's tough to cut in on a on a curve yeah. on an angle. It doesn't really work as well. And I'm always amazed that people don't just fall. Like they don't like clip each other's shoe. I know. <laughs> and I think that it's all about that kind of respect to each other. Because if you do that, then that's that other person's race is just. Be great. If, well, that's like they were showing. We can't show this, but there was. Uh, I retweeted it yesterday, but it's the remember if. Sean and Miller could have just done this, and it's like from like the 60s. Yeah. And the person behind who came in second in like the 200 or 400 meter just goes like, punches the girl in the back of the head <laughs> as she's crossing the finish line. <laughs> Jesus. And by the way, it wouldn't be an Olympic story on TYT Sports without ending with a just a, a piece of punditry that I am so happy to bring to this platform is the Brazilian synchronized divers, I believe, right. who uh, didn't medal as well they finished last place actually because they had because some they had some inner squad conflict the night before jason what was that conflict surrounding pretty sure one of them came back to the olympic village and saw uh her teammate in bed with another person <laughs> <laughs> she was not she didn't have her eyes on the prize and uh, the other one got mad i'm not sure if there was actually a relationship going on between uh, the one diver and the other man that was there maybe there was some backstabbing going on but it wasn't good for team chemistry and therefore, they finished last, but someone had to use those 12,000 condoms that were dropped into the village. The backstab, what a beautiful finishing diving move you can use. It's a the great backstab. one. <laughs> Get you 0, 0.0 points. <laughs> Comments. I'm sure there'll be tons. Let us know. The Olympics. Uh, how many more days have we got? Have we got not much. I think, it, I think the closing ceremony is the 21st. I could be wrong. Interesting. Five days. So it's coming to an end. What have you thought of the Olympics so far? What did you think of the dive finishes in the comments? What did you think of Jason's story? What do you think about imagining Jason running a 1600 meter? How short were his shorts? They Maybe were put a little Photoshop together. Bad. And I'll see you guys. I mean, I don't know if I can find any, but they were like. All right, you've got the limit. Go higher. I want a pair of Margaret Robbie's Suicide Squad Harley Quinn pants Ooh. on Jason's legs. Don't ask my time in the comments section. It was shite. Still finished second, though. But according to Pierce Morgan, that doesn't mean anything. <laughs>